Hey Libra, welcome to Queen Airbender Tarot. Today we're going to do your general love read for the week of October 23rd to the 30th. Keep in mind we do love reads every Wednesday as we, as I work with the goddess Venus. That's the energy we work with and she rules over Wednesdays. I have already charged your deck with your organite puck and your personalized zodiac sign card. I am an intuitive reader so I will read the traditional sense of the card but I pick up energies intuitively and that's the message that I will relay. I do two cards. One is your main energy and the second as you're clarifying in the possible outcome, okay? So let's get started. I hope everybody's having a good day. We're going to do two cards. One for your general and one for your outcome, possible outcome. Also, keep in mind, today is October 23rd, the very first day of Scorpio season, okay? So, um, as I mentioned, the goddess Venus, right, she rules over Wednesday and she helps with anything related to love, beauty, and finance. So, clear your heart chakra will be very important today because these energies with Scorpio for a lot of people is a little challenging, right? So, you want to work... At, wow, everybody's being real stubborn today. <laughs> I feel like I feel like it's Scorpio energy because Scorpios are not so open with their feelings and emotions. They're not very blunt. Even though Libras are pretty good at talking about their emotions and feelings, Scorpios kind of keep things to themselves. So that energy affects every single zodiac, not just you, Libra. Everybody, it affects everybody. So every time we have an astrological shift, you should balance your energy accordingly. Clear your energy from the last astrological um, energies. Okay, Libra. Okay. What do we got? Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. You have the Chariot in reverse as your main energy. Something regarding some a relationship possibly not moving forward the way you wanted it to. Oh, this one didn't even want to go in. You see how it's flipped out. The Knight of Cups. Okay. Both are, well, so the chariot is the cancer and tarot, and then you have the Knight of Cups, that's another water sign. You could possibly be dealing with another water sign, or this could be just your energy. No. Okay, I say that because Libra, for some reason, I always connect energetically Libra with water signs. Because Libra of all the air signs, Libra's air sign, but Libra is um, more emotional. Than the air signs like Gemini and Aquarius are not as emotionally open, but Libras are Libras are very I won't say very emotional, but they're more in tune with their emotions. They they speak on things in a more emotional manner, especially when it pertains to love. Gemini's and Aquarius is they don't they're not as open with how they feel about things emotionally. So let's get a clarifying card for the chariot. What is our clarifying card for the chariot? I think I'm and I'm also picking up that because I keep thinking about Scorpio and today is the first day. Ooh, that one flew out. You have the six of pentacles to clarify your chariot. I keep picking up the Scorpio energy and I feel like it's going to affect you strongly, Libra, because I keep seeing over and over again. I keep wanting to call you Scorpio. I feel like Scorpio season is really going to affect you strongly. And that doesn't mean that it's in a negative way, but I feel like it is going to affect you very strongly. I feel like you're picking up the energy and you're feeling it already, right? Yeah. Whoever this reading is for, I'm picking up that Scorpio season is really, it's already affecting them. And I feel like it's been affecting you days for days before, days before it even started. You were feeling the energies of Scorpio season. Give me one card to clarify our Knight of Cups. One card to clarify our Knight of Cups. Ooh, and that one flipped out. The Magician. Okay, let's see what we got here. Libra, Libra, Libra. Okay, Libra. Your very first card is the Chariot. I'm going to turn it up right so that you can see the details in it. Your Chariot came up in reverse. So there's a lack of forward movement in a relationship. But I sense that you want this forward movement. And I say that because you have the Knight of Cups upright. I feel like this is you, Libra. You want some forward movement about something, but something is halting it. Something is going on where something is blocking forward movement with you and this possible love interest. And again, like I said, the chariot is 
And tarot is cancer. So you could possibly be dealing with a cancer. There's a blockage in for a movement. But regardless, and I feel like, okay, this is what I'm picking up. The chair is a cancer. And then your possible outcome is the Knight of Cups. So it could be the cancer who's blocking this forward movement. And for your clarifying card for the chariot, you have the Six of Pentacles. When you look at this card, the Six of Pentacles, somebody's giving somebody some crumbs. They have skill. But interesting enough, in this deck, this scale is balanced. And that's you, right? Libra. Balance. Hmm. Interesting. Because the Libra is the scales. So here's two scenarios. It could be the Cancer, a possible Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Water Sign, who is halting things. But I feel like this if this person is halting things, it might be because they feel like you are juggling people. Because you have two people here. Somebody is offering somebody crumbs. And then there's another person watching on. So if you're dealing with a water sign, Libra, they may possibly be putting a halt to movement because they feel like you're dealing with another person. And with that being said, I feel like that because your outcome card for your cups is the magician. We know the magician is able to manifest things, but also magician is pretty intuitive, right? The magician is intuitive and this came up right. So in cancers, if you're dealing with a cancer, we do know cancers are intuitive, right? You do know that. I hope you do. Okay. And if you're dealing with a cancer and you're dealing with multiple people, because like I said, you have two people there, right? Chances are this cancer has already found out. Magician. They're, they use their intuition and they found out about you dealing with another person. And that may be why they halted that forward movement. Again, because your, your, your chariot is in reverse. It's not moving forward. There's a halt. So I'm going to read this two different ways because your Knight of Cups came up right. And then you have the Magician. So either A, this water sign that you could possibly be dealing with, knows about this other person. And they're going to act on it. They're either they're going to be manipulative and they're going to find ways to dig and get more information from you. That's what I'm picking up, Libra. Because again, I'm going to say, I feel like it's you. Who's doing the behind the scene with with two different people? Because this this person is holding a scale, right? And we know the scale is about Libras. Libras is a scale. So I feel like it's you, Libra. Libra, you might be entertaining two different people, and then you know you have, to, and then with your chariot. Okay, so I'm I'm picking this up very strongly, Libra. Look at this chariot. You have two different, you know. You have two different energies, right? Completely different energies. One is darker, one is light. And if we're talking about people, right? Two different people. They're not the same color. They're not the same exact, you know, being. And if you look at the chair, look how this person is looking off. Like, what's going on here? You know, look at how she's looking. And I feel like this, if you're dealing with a cancer... Like I said, you you have the Knight of Cups, and then you have Chariot, which is Water Sign Cancer. If you're dealing with a Cancer, this Cancer has used the intuition, and they know they know that you're dealing with another person. It's definitely you, Libra. You're dealing with another person, and this Cancer knows about it, and so they're halting for a movement in this relationship. Because again, your Chariot came in reverse. They're halting for a movement because they know that you're dealing with another person. And either A, like I said, intuitively as a magician, they, they have dug up some details about you because magi the magician can manifest some things, okay? They can pull up some information about you and find out what you're really up to and what you're really doing. Or this could be you because the way these cards are together, even though it's upright, because, you know, in reverse, there's somebody being sneaky and manipulative. I still feel like if it's not this person's energy and it's you, you could possibly be trying to get over on this person. Tell them, like, no, everything's on the up and up. Look at this arm up in the air. Everything's on the up and up. I'm not being sneaky. I'm not being manipulative. It's just me and you. But there's somebody else involved. And even if you're not in a serious relationship with this person or this person of interest, you're still entertaining two people. You like somebody more than the other one because this person is just getting breadcrumbs. They're just, you know, they have their hand out and they're taking whatever. You're just offering them whatever you feel like offering them. And it, I feel like they're accepting it. 
but there's somebody else here. And again, I'm picking up a strong water sign. You are dealing possibly with a water sign. This blue, you know, it makes me think of water. This is the person. And look at that. The scale is right over this person's head, right? So I'm picking up very strongly that you're dealing with a water sign. But you're, you're dealing with two people and this water sign knows, right? The magician. They know. Somehow, magician, they found out and manifested some information about you. Again, Knight of Cups. You're dealing with a water sign, Libra. And if they're not a water sign sun, you know, it's sun, moon, rising, or Venus. You're dealing with a water sign. And this water sign knows. And, and if you look at the magician, he has a candle. And it's a double-sided candle. And it might be something else, but the way I'm seeing it, it looks like a candle. And it's lit on both ends, right? You see a little faux flame, right? So this person, they have their hand up and they're putting light to the situation. They're illuminating the situation. You see the background is yellow. You're not hiding. If you're being sneaky and you're dating somebody else or you're entertaining two people, it's coming to the light. Look at that yellow in the background. This situation has come to the light. This person knows that you're dealing with two different people. Okay? Two different people. Two different chariots. Then they call them Spinks. You know, they're two different, they're two different entities, two different people. You know, again, two different people. And this is you. This is you, Libra. So if you're trying to juggle two different people, Libra, this person that you're dealing with, they know about it. So just keep that in mind. Okay. So thank you for joining me today. Until next time, like, share, and subscribe. Take care. Bye.